Hi guys, Paul from PA Brew News. Hat on, Harry's mess, just woke up. Um, Saturday, the 9th of April, or May, beer mail. Who's from? Ethan. Who's Ethan? I don't know. Ethan from Ethan's Beer Reviews. All the way from Ohio. Which is nice, you know, it's nice sending beers so close, kind of next door neighbor, you save a little bit of money. Not much, but a little bit. So, uh, just really thankful for Ethan sending his beer mail. Uh, at first, I, I think he sent some, like, you know, don't worry about it. Like, I'm going to send some back. I don't know about the awesomeness he said. I'm probably not going to send that, because, you know, probably just send him some Lamarita or something. I don't know. Drinking a uh, 400 pound monkey English IPA. Damn. Oh. 400 pound monkey. This is also a beer review. Here you go. Earthy, bitey, peppery, herbal. I mean, it, bam, they nailed this one. Soft, bready, biscuity, malt. Oh, yeah. That's good. It's getting, it's probably going to get a nine for me. That was a quick one, but moving on. Super excited about this. 2014 Jack O's Dark Apparition Russian Imperial Stout. <laughs> super excited to try this. Super, super, super. Super excited. Great Lakes Brewing Company, Alberta Clipper Porter. Awesome. Ooh, that's a good one. <laughs> that's good. Rise of the Mind Dog uh, Chocolate Honey Stout. Something tells me I've tried this already, but I don't know. <coughs> Alright, Siberian Night Imperial Stout. Thirsty Dog Brewing Company. Here we go. Bourbon barrel age Siberian night for thirsty dog. Super, super, super um, excited about that. I'm gonna do a side by side probably video. I don't know if I'm gonna review one, review the other, then do a side by side, or probably just do a side by side. That would probably be the best thing. Okay. Just in case I screw it up, there's another. Bourbon barrel age Siberian night for thirsty dog. Thank you for sending me two. Okay. All right, here's a big one. Evil Twin Brewing Company and Omega Brewing Company's collab from Omega with Love. A 12% Imperial Stout with blueberries added. Super awesome. Super, super awesome. Okay. And finally, last but not least, The Abyss from Deschutes 2014 Reserve. I've had a couple years from this. I really wanted to try to find the uh, 2014, and I didn't. On my travels, I couldn't find it. He sent me one. How cool is that? So, that is... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Eight, eight awesome, awesome beers. Can't wait to try them. Um, mostly from Ohio, which is cool. Um, the only ones that aren't from Ohio are the big ones, I think, because I think... Uh, I think Jackie O's is also from Ohio. Or India. Yeah. Well, oh, Athens, Ohio. Awesome. Great. Great. Lo local stuff from him. And these two big boys right here. So I'm very happy. And, uh, and, and this actually, this 400 pound monkey is a real nice drop. Especially if you like the earthy, more, more earthy little bit of soft mint, soft, like crunchy, crunchy herbal notes. So that kind of pops for the IPAs. This is really nice. It definitely does taste like a kicked up English bitter with a beautiful balance of hops. I think you'll like it. Definitely go get that a go. This has been Paul from PA Brew News. Thank you. Thanks a lot, Ethan. And, uh, and just to do a personal send out, I think I'm just going to eat some chips.
The mustache one put mustaches all over the box. How awesome is that?